Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So on the channel, we talk quite a lot about making sure that your browsers are up to date. Because most web browsers are configured to update automatically, which is something that happens in the background. And this also includes Google Chrome. And the reason um, we make sure our browsers are up to date, especially for security reasons, is because your browser, to some extent or the other, is your first line of defense to the online world. So having it uh, patched is always a good idea. Now, for whatever reason, if you don't want to have the automatic updates running in the background on Google Chrome and for Google Chrome, just a quick video to show you how you can actually disable and stop these automatic Google Chrome updates on Windows from running and updating the browser automatically. And may, there could be a couple of reasons for this. Um, maybe you just don't want to upgrade to a newer version for maybe there's an issue and you just want to wait for that issue to be fixed before you upgrade. Or maybe you want to have a little bit more control over how updates are applied to your system with for Google Chrome. And another one could be um, because updates that run in the background, especially when you start up your PC, as an example, Google Chrome has processes that are looking for the update and this can slow down the startup of your system, especially on a, a low budget machine. So for performance reasons, this could also be um, a reason you may want to stop these automatic updates. And just a quick side note here, and obviously I need to say this, a quick word of caution. Um, I'm not actually recommending this, especially to your, own, your average home user. And um, this would be more for your advanced user, because obviously when you stop updates, it could leave your browser um, open to threat and attack. And um, so if you want to do this, just continue at your own risk. So with that all out of the way, let's show you how to um, stop those updates running automatically um, in the background um, in Google Chrome on Windows. Now, there's two methods we're going to use um, in this video. There are others, but these are the quick and the easiest as far as I'm concerned. So what we need to do is we need to head over to to our services. Now, if you don't know where services are, just do a search for services. But you will find them in the Windows tools on Windows 11. And I think that's called Windows, sorry, Ad administrator tools over on Windows 10. But just do a search for services. That's the best. So you head to services. And these are all the different services that are running and um, in the background automatically. And some of them are enabled manually and some of them have been paused. And some of them have actually been stopped. So what we do in this list is we scroll down to the G, um, the G listing. And here are the two updater services for Google Chrome. There's the first one. And there's the second one. I hope you can see that properly in the video. So what we need to do is we need to double click on those. You need to change automatic to disabled because this is what runs automatically when you boot up your PC. And then the next one is Google Updater Service. There we go. And if it's if the the process the sorry, if the service is running, you must just stop it, but this normally runs at startup, so it should be stopped currently. You just uh, toggle that to disabled, click apply, and there we go. And if you always if if in the future if you want to um re-enable these services, you just repeat the process. You would come back, click on that, and you would change that to automatic, and then you would click on start. Okay, so that's how you can reverse the process if you if you change your mind and you want the updates to continue. So that's how you can use services to stop those updates. And then, then the next one is task scheduler, which can also be found in Windows tools over on Windows 11 or administrator tools. Um, over on Windows 10, or I would just do a search for Task Scheduler if you don't know where that is. That would be the easiest. We open that. And yet to the left-hand side, you expand that um, drop-down list. And now you'll see Google Updater and Google Updater. So anything with Google, just check for Google Updater. So you would click on that. There we go. You click on that actual task. Because this is when, when it schedules to update your, your actual browser. And then what I would suggest is I would just disable that actual um, task. I wouldn't delete it. I would disable it. Because you can always come back once again and re-enable that. And you do those with any Google updater that's found here to the left-hand uh, side in the side uh, menu for the task scheduler. And that's it, guys. That's 
two easy kind of methods or ways you can stop those um, Google updates from running automatically in the background. But just remember, if you do this, obviously your browser, the longer you leave it, your browser will be become more open to threat and attack. But I just thought I'd put it out there because as mentioned, there could be a couple of reasons this may be beneficial. And you can always reverse the process to enable those updates as shown again in the video um, for whatever reason. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.